Welcome back to the next episode of Dishonor. As always, thank you all for watching. I appreciate you. I really do. Episode number eight. Meh. Let's continue. That's a nice and easy one. Are you fucking kidding me? The one time I fucking need rats, I kill him. And there's no other rats in the area. What the fucking joke? Sustained rage. Adrenaline. I don't even know what the fuck that means. Guys, just chilling out there. There's no other guy out there. Nice little peaceful corner. Another dude down here. But one dude it's not a problem. Yeah, not a problem. I now turn my hopes and energies to Formula 25, which in conjunction with the high heat that <laughs> Does he not have a key? He has a key. Kid, what's up? 
Leave me be. Thank you, whoever you are. He kept me in a cage, like an animal. The pain is horrible right now. So I'll just hide in a corner and leave when I'm feeling better. Okay, whatever. So carry this guy to boatman on the bridge near my home. His home. Where the fuck is it? Oh, he's not that far away. And then that's it. That's it. For real, nothing more. Oh, seems too easy. Hey, can I buy your ration of elixir from today? Hmm. Huh. I can go all the way down there, right? I'ma play it safe. Good thing I played it safe. The royal physician himself. You made a neat job of it. Drop him here and we'll be off. Eh. Done deal. Good shit, right? Probably. They set up a cell for Sokolov in the old kennel. Shackles and everything. It'll be a shock him waking up in the straw and old dog poop. But from what I hear, he's woken up worse places. Guess we all have at that. I doubt a dozen soldiers could have done it better. Sokolov's knowledge will enable us to strike at the Lord Regent directly, and ultimately help you get your life back. Soon, we won't have to hide in the shadows. The Royal Physician is brilliant, but he was a fool to protect the Lord Regent. Sokolov gave us the elixir, the war machine. It could have made us a great nation. Now he pays the price for siding with the time. You have my thanks, sir. If you wish to get some sleep, now is a good time. And say goodbye to Emily. I want Emily. Where is Emily? Oh, there's a bone charm. Oh, it's dead bone charm. I can get that bone charm. Pendleton Manor will be closed for a private ceremony. Following the tragic loss of two of our city's best and brightest, the Lords Custis and Morgan Pendleton. All holdings and parliamentary votes now fall to Lord Trevor Pendleton, who asks for respect during this time of mourning. Son of a bitch. Bend in the apartment key needed. So I need to find an apartment key. Uh, where the fuck would an apartment key be? Attention Dunwall citizens. Be aware that looting of evacuated areas is a serious offense and will be summarily punished by officers of the watch. Display your pride in Dunwall. You are respecting the property and rights of others in these trying times and preserving the timeless beauty of our fair city. 
We won't start the interrogation without you. Where do I find a good meal around here? If you think prison food's bad, you should see what the Abbey serves its captives. I think the overseers make it themselves. Lord Pendleton has departed for the evening to attend to matters at the manor. It concerns the departure of his brother. Dies. I'm sure you understand. Hmm. You are required to boil any water from public fountains or the river. Anyone who has consumed untreated water must be reported to the watch. Fuck is that motherfucking key. I don't think I'll find the key. La di da di da di da. Now where is Emily? La di da di da di da 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 la di da da. Emily Caldwell was abducted some six months past at the moment of her mother's terrible murder. Anyone with information leading to the location or return of the daughter of our beloved late Empress is required to speak to the city watch at once. I don't even know where the fuck she is, but I have her. Yo. Do you know where Emily is? What's your name? Mir... Mi... Kea Nice? Mir Kea Nice? Is that an R? I don't know. I can't read, bro. Erdol. Oh. It's only these buildings, right? Normally, I'm a natural philosopher, but today, consider me a humble craftsman here to serve. Still, boot still. Okay. Upgrades. Now that we have Sokolov as a guest, ask him how he deluded the Academy into making him royal physician. Ask him how he stole my elixir for me. Will you do that for me? Where the fuck is this girl, bro? Is she in there? Please ah. be as quiet as you can. It took forever for Emily to fall asleep. Poor dear. It's okay, Emily, I'm here. She seems happier when you're here. Though I know you have important things to do. Out there, in the city. Yeah. Finally found her. Please, please leave a candle for me. I, I can't see in here and I, I can't see my mother. I just want a candle. Where is Corvo? I'm right here, bro. Well then, I suppose I will go to bed then. Right? Yeah. Ah.
time to rest. So yeah, thank you for watching and did you follow? You did follow. Thank you. Uh, how do you how do I say your name properly? Like Mir Mir Kea. Nice. Corvo, wake up. I'll call you nice you guy. Were making funny faces while you were sleeping. I decided to nap here in your room while Callista was taking her bath. She told me if there's ever trouble, I should always run here. Indeed, you should. Calissa will come get me when she's done with her bath. Thanks, Corvo. It makes me feel better. Yeah. Okay, so now I'll go interrogate the motherfucker. Stay nice. Royal wow. position. I believe you and Corvo knew each other in former days. Unlike you, our friend Corvo knows what loyalty means. Bah! I am loyal to my inner spirit. You are the one consorting with the most wanted man in the Empire. It's my belief that Corvo was innocent in the death of the Empress, and the former spymaster, or the Lord Regent, as he calls himself, was a ruthless tyrant bent on destroying the city, the heart of the Empire. You are mistaken if you think there's love between me and our Lord Regent. But whatever you intend to do here, I assure you, I am beyond petty scare tactics. If I don't scare you, Sokolov, perhaps these rats do. Even if they don't carry clay, I've heard of a swarm of rats stripping a child's body to the bone in half a minute. I've heard worse. How long do you think it'll be before you talk? Before you beg to talk? Rats? Is that the company you keep now, Admiral? It's the company you keep that interests us, Sokolov. We know you painted a portrait of the Lord Regent's mistress. The very aristocrat who is funding the military with her fortune. She is the key to the Lord Regent's control over the city, and we must have her name. Sorry, Admiral. I cannot help you. Guess it's my turn. Rabble, but I know you have your reasons. Yes, he does. All we need is the name of the Lord Regent's mistress. It's very simple. I elect not to tell you. You will have to force the words from me, and I warn you, my willpower is quite legendary. A curious strategy. Of which I approve. Buy a bribe. What's this? No clue, but anyway. Attention Dunwall citizens. The Ascendancy Circle has chosen Teague Martin to be High Overseer. Let us... I know it looks... I was inventing a new kind of lock. The tumblers shaped like snowflakes. The truth is, there is no snowflake lock. I was just, you know, looking through the lock. I realize, well, everything you're thinking, I already realize. I'm a natural philosopher, but that doesn't mean I'm not a gentleman. Or, I try to be. I get it, bro. I get it. Wow, you can see a whole lot of nothing. I can just open it. Can't you see? I'm about to bathe. <laughs> I understand. It was an accident. We have such a hard time maintaining privacy in such a crowded house, don't we? Yeah, indeed we do. 
Well, bye. Uh, bro, I need, I need, I need a bribe, bro. Attention, Dunwall citizens. Be aware that looting of evacuated areas is a serious. It's well known that Sokolov is virtually addicted to a rare liquor called King Street Brandy. The taste is revolting, but I happen to have a bottle. However. I am reluctant to give it to you for Sokolov. It cost me quite a lot. It is very expensive stuff. A How much? Of rare Pendician spices and a drop of whale oil. Would you care to purchase it? Yes. I don't care about money. Did I do it right? My arc pylon will eclipse the old Sokolov model. You require my unique services? We can quickly return to my shop. No, no, I'm, I'm good. What's that? Book. Don't care. I could use a drink. Indeed you can. What? What? Didn't I just give him? What? Maybe I didn't do it right. You require my unique services? We can quickly return to my shop. Did I not do it right? What the fuck? Oh, he's right. Oh. Well. King Street Brandy. I didn't know any more existed. It is an extraordinary gift. I see I'm dealing with men of taste. I can tell you this much. She was always referred to as Lady Boyle. I painted her to be sure, but I never saw her face or learned her first name. You see, I painted her from behind. I assure you, she still makes a striking portrait. But I do not know which Boyle she is. I was to be introduced to her at a masked ball in her honor this very night. But I will miss that party, it seems. A masked ball at the Boyle estate. Tonight, the timing is perfect, Corvo. But the Boyles are wealthy and ruthless, so security will be very tight. Of course, you already have a mask, don't you, Corvo? He's right. You will be able to mingle with them once you're on the ground. You'll have to find out which of the Boyle women is connected to the Lord Regent and take her out in whatever way you can devise. We're very close now. If you do this tonight, you'll be able to strike at the Lord Regent himself and put Emily on the throne. May the wind favor you. Wow, this game really isn't long, but... I hear you're off to the Boyle's little bash tonight. I have just a tiny favor I'd like to ask you. Could you give this note to Lord Shaw? You'll know him. A rather brusque man wearing a wolf's mask. In fact, he may be looking for me. Yeah, sure. Can I also look at the note that I'm delivering? I guess not, eh? Nothing. Uh, I guess I'll go see Emily. Before I leave for... Of course. Did you ever see pirates? And did you sink me? Of course. Dozens. Oh, yes. But that's not for young girls to hear about. But I will be Empress, won't I? And then I'll have to sink lots of enemy ships myself. And that's what Empresses do mostly, isn't it? 
Of course. I knew it! I read that some pirate ships have witches aboard that can cause storms and make whales do what they want. Is that true? Well, yes. Okay. Uh, There's nothing here, right? There, there's nothing. There's the royal costume ball, huh? Well, that'll be fun, but not for everybody. You ready? Yeah, sure. yourself Corvo they don't fool around the good news is once you get to the party that mask of yours lets you blend right in enjoy your evening out with a cloak of quality better you than me so can I just walk right in or not I don't think I can okay, so where is this party at Oh, it's right there. Guess left I go. That's the shit I don't like. Oh, damn it, that's reds. I guess he's just infected, so. Can't actually carry him. Now, where is this? Slightly increased max health. Okay. I don't really break glass. Going to a party, Corvo? Yes. Is that what you dreamed of? All those months in Cold Ridge Prison while waiting for the executioner? Well, Beautiful women in the latest fashion, laughing and drinking Tibian wine, 
and what of the host, Lady Boyle? I can see all her tomorrows, and I know that either she dies tonight at your hand, or she'll live out her days, month after month, year after year, far away, even as her fine clothes wear into tatters and her silken hair gets dull and gray. Half the city can see the lights from the party, and they dream of the delights inside. Will you tear it all to pieces? Either way, it's Lady Boyle's last party. Okay, so how many do I have now? Two, right? Two. I don't really like to kill, so that's a no. Like the Devouring Swarm is the only one that I actually would use, perhaps. What are those? Some good ass barricades. Anyways. Time to move forward. That way. But man, there's a lot of weepers in this building. Oh, that's a nice place. What the fuck are those things? So I actually need to go there. Oh, there's also a rune in the water over there. Such a This puts you way out of position. I was wondering why I couldn't just go up there. It's very strange. Yeah, I, I definitely can go up there. That thing is definitely gonna see me. I need to get motherfuckers. Let's just see what happens if I get another. Crack at this guy. Look out, we got someone skulking around. 
How does he know? I don't like those things, bro. Red scent. That's it. That's it. I do have to go all the way back outside, or not. Luckily, I do not. Would you look at that? I can just go straight into here. Okay, well. That's useless. No, let's get up and over. Yeah, I cannot go up and over. Fun for a season, but now what is it tonight? Okay. Seems good. <clears throat> what a yes. mask. Pendleton? Hmm. What's he got to say to me? Pendleton is a gutless lying sack of shit. I hope he's paying you well for this. What? It's damn cold tonight. Hurry up and let's see what you're made of. Be it noted that Lord Pendleton's representative has a pistol. You may proceed. What? Contest of honor will take place between this anonymous gentleman acting for the challenger Lord Trevor Pendleton and Lord Shaw, the challenged party. You will each turn and proceed to the marked positions and remain facing away from each other as I count down from three. You may then turn and fire Get on him. with it. I'll kill this fool and we can all go back inside. What? Sorry, my lord. We shall proceed. I did not expect this standoff. Stop. Stand right there. Three. Two. One. Ouch. And that's another patron dead. What do we do now? It's lucky we're in demand. I hear the Estermonts pay top coin. 
No use trying them tonight. Let's see if we can find a little brandy. Let the boils clean up the mess. Why did he have to die? But why did I have to kill him? <sighs> Things are bad. Could the city get any worse? Chances are very good. Welcome to the boil. The party's indoors this time. Mm -hmm. Oh my, that's wicked. Who made that mask for you? It's exactly like the wanted posters. That's going to cast a pall over the whole evening. I think I'm starting to enjoy myself. Hello. The Boyles hope you have a wonderful time today. Guess I'll go. Careful. We tried for a peek upstairs and the man on duty is an ass. I should have taught him some manners. This party is a sham. I'm sure he's just doing his job. A party like this, anyone might have crept it. Excuse me, my coat. Mm, is a marquee. Of course I don't mean you. <laughs> he actually signed it with his name, bro. What the fucking funny guy this the guy. People are desperate. And the boils are awfully wealthy these days. Nonsense. Waverly just hires officers from the watch to impress people. Your obsession with the boils. Get wherever you're going. Will it never end? Ugh, you smell like the streets. Been slumming it, have you? <laughs> Jeez. You know about Mrs. Brimsley? You'll never believe this. What is it now? She had her jobber pick up a boy. Welcome to the Boyle Estate. You. I see. tonight we must speak privately okay what I do have you snacks. see this as an opportunity to what learn a trade join the city hold on I need a cigar I'm a friend of Pendleton's, and I've done a few favors for your cause. I know your purpose here tonight, and, how to say this, your target is the woman I love. I swear that if you'll bring her to me unharmed, you will never hear of her again. There's a cellar directly below the kitchen. I'll wait for you there. Okay. I'm not proud of this, but surely it's better than seeing her killed. Probably her is. Lydia. I won't harm her, I swear. I'm a man of means. Just bring her to the cellar, and I will keep her safe with me, forever. I don't really care if you arm or not. I, I don't even know what this what this woman entails, but I don't I don't really care about this fucking woman. Bro. Evening, sir. Evening. Try Miss White in the moth mask. I hear she's lonely. Who? She? Welcome to the Boyle Estate. Welcome to my party. I don't believe you've had the pleasure. Ah, that's Boyle. And she already knows that I'm not even invited. How the fuck do I kidnap her? Good evening. I trust you are on the guest list, Hello, sir. Oh, there's multiple. Really? Well, don't mind if I do. Really? I know it's a party, but I...
Okay, uh, optional, gather information by uh, talking with guests. I do identify which costume your target is wearing. Eliminate Lady Boy, only knock out Lady Boy, and deliver her life to the basement. I will knock her. I don't like killing. Oh, it's already 45 minutes. Well, then I'm gonna end this episode and start the next episode. So, thank you all for watching. See you next time. Alright, bye.